Hello dear friends, my subscribers and guests of my channel. I am Lyubov Offenhuisel and this is my fashion review. I want to talk about knitted shoes. I have prepared for you a video of knitted shoes, moccasins and dungarees. These are amazing handmade shoes. I have presented here photos of the works of several masters. Some of them are Zinia, Madame Sapojek, Irina Kolodova, Mary Pon, Natalia Trofimenko, and Natalia Clothes for Your Feet. These master craftswomen have mastered this craft and make such shoes to order or sell ready-made ones. Personally, I am inspired by their work to do something similar myself because the feeling when you wear things made by your own hands is very different from wearing bought things. It is inexpressible in words, coziness and satisfaction. Try to make such shoes yourself. I think it is not so difficult for any woman who can knit. When I was a young girl, my mother knitted me moccasins. She took the soles of old shoes and knitted new very beautiful shoes. At that time, there was not much variety of shoes in my country. That's why beautiful moccasins in a single copy made me very happy. By the way, in the comments to the previous videos with knitted shoes, there was often a question about the sole. Where can I buy a suitable sole? You can use soles from old shoes, as my mom did once, of course, if they are in good condition. You can also find new soles online, although I didn't find the sole I needed on any website. You can also buy a cheap shoe with a sole you like and have it remade. If you found another way to find a good sole, post in the comments. Without a doubt, handmade shoes have many advantages. For example, you can knit shoes under a knitted dress or a knitted bag. Hand-knitted shoes can be a great addition to many sets of knitted clothes. And also, knitted shoes have an unusual charm and style, created by you personally. Knitted shoes are your personal expression of your individual view of style and fashion. Of course, these shoes should be handled with care. These shoes require careful care. But, no matter how neatly require such shoes, to buy or knit yourself, such shoes are still worth it. One more question. What yarn to knit such shoes? I think the main thing durable. After all, the shoes take on all the weight and manner of walking. Of course, also want soft and cozy shoes. Therefore, when choosing yarn, you need to consider all these aspects. Another advantage of knitted shoes is the ability to tie any size. Such shoes can appreciate the owners of very small or very large foot size. After all, women with a small or large foot is not so easy to find shoes in stores. However, you can knit any model for any size. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, then be sure to subscribe. On my channel you will find more fashion reviews of knitted dresses, coats, hats and other necessary things. Also, don't forget to watch videos of my works and master classes. Enjoy your viewing and good mood. <laughs>